Hi, betting experts. On Wednesday, September the 4th, are off up to Bath for a competitive card on rattling fast ground as usual at the track. There's no watering system, so it's one of the quickest tracks in the country, particularly over the sprint track. We start off with our betting expert daily nap. This goes in the 202. It's the Dragon Bet born from the betting ring handicap. Five furlongs and 10 yards. Class five, three year olds only. £3,700 to the winner. And I think Lock Harbour can win here for Scott Dixon now. Scott's had a winner in the last 14 days. He tends to operate at a fairly low level, mainly on the all-weather. This one he got from Carl Burke. Started off from a mark of 64 at Wolverhampton in July. Well beaten there under a £7 claim, but much more like it when backed at long odds at Chepstow over six furlongs on very quick ground on the 15th of August. Running really well there, just edged out by the well back favourite Outer Edge in a tight finish. That came from a mark of 61 under Jason Watson. Luke Morris is in the saddle this afternoon from the same mark and the reason you're getting a decent price is a lesser effort at Southall last time out beaten seven and a half lengths uh, behind my Aweli there that was just nine days ago um, never really landing a blow probably not La Carba's track back on fast turf here drop back to five furlongs they're going to go a right gallop there's two real tra- trailblazers in this lineup at least and I think La Carba will be finishing very strongly over this five and hopefully they'll take each other on in front but Burn each other off and Le Carba can weave his way through late under Morris. Our betting expert value angle selection goes in the 332. It's the Dragon Bet proud sponsors of Bath Racing Handicap. Nearly six furlong, class six, three year olds and upwards. £2,983 to the winner. I think Media Guest must run well here for Mark Gillard. Now, this one is completely exposed, but he's been a pretty good money spinner, particularly um, on the turf. He's run 25 times, he's only won twice, but he's in the been in the frame on nine occasions he basically needs rattling quick ground and he's best at Bath his last win in fact his only win this season came over this course and distance on the 17th of July uh, narrowly edging out foreseeable future from a mark of 56 under Keneary who's back in the saddle this afternoon media guest last time out at Google didn't run badly by any means finishing fifth that was under a five pound claim on ground that was too soft for him he was a big drifter as it rained that day at Goodwood and the ground turned good to soft which wouldn't be his game. He's also probably struggles to see out six. I think this sharper track on fast ground, absolutely ideal. Uh, And he's bound to go close here with any luck in running. Best of luck on Wednesday, betting experts. And please do remember to like and comment on all of our YouTube videos.